really important if you're various different ethnic groups, you want to make sure that the surgeon who you pick really has some comfort with that particular ethnic group. So today we're going to start with Latino Hispanic patients, sort of what are the main differences in underlying structure and then maybe what are some of the differences aesthetically that those patients typically ask for. So it's really important when we're talking about different ethnic groups, we're, we're using these broad strokes and generalizations, but in truth when we see a lot of Latino patients from all over the world, there's a tremendous amount of variation in different factors including aesthetics, but especially structural factors. Really, if we're going to use generalizations though, in an anatomically speaking, there are some differences. In general, a lot of our Latino patients tend to have a little bit thicker skin. And it's not necessarily just the skin itself. There's a layer of fibrous fatty tissue under the skin that tends to create a little bit of thickness, especially around the tip. And the tip cartilage itself often can be a little softer, have a little bit less support, and sometimes tend to want to be a little flatter and more driven. There is no one particular aesthetic. Um, it really depends on your facial structure itself. There are Hispanic Latino patients who have very sort of angular faces and you're going to want a more refined look. And then there's other patients who have a little bit more of a rounder, softer face and they're going to want a completely different aesthetic. Again, as with all the other patients in every other video we talk about, it's really important to establish that aesthetic with your surgeon. Something that is very important to a lot of people of different ethnic backgrounds is the concept of changing their identity. And a lot of people are afraid of having rhinoplasty, of losing something about their ethnic identity that somehow is family, familial or related. And uh, th that's a very important conversation to have with your surgeon. Again, there's huge variation in terms of what patients want as far as that goes. Many have the family knows and don't want to lose that and are looking to make smaller, more conservative changes. And other patients want a really significant, dramatic narrowing, uh, nostril reduction, maybe want to have a lot more refinement. So it's really important to have a very clear understanding with your surgeon of what you want to accomplish during surgery.